guys hey friends welcome back to my channel today i have for you guys a dollar tree haul um this is just a mix of a bunch of things that i found i am still on the hunt for the ice cream scoop um the resealable bags or the reusable bags not resealable and what was the other thing there was something else that I want to find and I still haven't found them and I see all of you guys oh thrifty Tiffany oh my lord ladies she found the most beautiful floral picks I have not seen those in my stores and I hope that I come across them because they are so beautiful it's like this beautiful mauve color check out her channel because she is amazing I'm sure you guys know of her. She does Dollar Tree hauls and a whole bunch of other things. But I did pick up these LED paper lanterns. Um, they had different prints. They had, I think, flamingos. They had um, pineapples. And I forget what else, but I picked these up with the turquoise. And it has that beautiful flower and then the leaves. I don't know where I'm going to put these outside on our balcony, but I just figured that it would be fun to get them. And if we can use them, we use them. If not, then oh well. But, you know, that's that. Then I found these Be Pure Overnight Pads with Organic Cotton, Aloe Infused, and Lavender Infused. No dyes, no chlorine, no added fragrances, and this one brings six. They did have the panty liners and i believe the regular maxi pads but they didn't have the super long ones and you know tmi but i like to use the overnight ones or the long ones um so i just picked these up to see how they work and see if they're any good you know for a buck 25 you cannot go wrong then oh my lord you guys i found these first of all this gives me Ray Dunn vibes, just the the boldness of the print. It reminds me of Ray Dunn. I picked one up in pink and one in black. The funny thing is that I am in the process of trying to organize my vanity in um, my bedroom. So this is going to work perfectly for me. <laughs> the only thing is that I have a ton of makeup. So... I guess maybe I can use these for the brushes, like all my eye brushes, my face brushes, and then this maybe put a few lip liners or lipsticks. I don't know. I gotta play around with it and see. And I did I did pick this up with the thought process of me keeping the pink and giving the black to my daughter or vice versa. Unless I need all two. I don't know, guys. I have a mess of makeup. And with that in mind, I picked these up. I think I got two of these let me see you guys let me put this here and this yes so i did get two of these and the reason i got this is because this is perfect for your lip liners some of your eyeshadow brushes lipsticks i'm actually going to show you because i have some lip products that i found from wet and wild let me take out some of the makeup stuff that i have in here so this is the gel lip balm by wet and wild um it says pout and love there was another color does this have a name it has a number but it does not have a name but there was another color but the other color was a little too red for me um, I just knew that when I put it on, I wasn't going to like the color. So this one was more on the pink, pink mauve side. But we're going to try it out and I'm going to put it in this little organizer and see. So this is what it looks like. And I only saw two color options. You can bring it up. Let's swatch. Oh, this is, this has like no color guys at all. yeah it's oh i don't know there's like a weird scent but i guess if you apply it a few times it gives you a little bit of shine but see like 
look at how perfect that is. And then they had this one. This one, they only had this one shade. This is called the Liquid Katsu. It says Mega Last Liquid Katsu High Shine Lipstick. Um, again, it doesn't have a name. It only has a number. Let's swatch this one and let's see what this one is about. Sorry, guys. My nails... I just got them done um, yesterday and it takes a little bit of time for me to take things out with them. So just bear with me. Okay, here we go. So that's what it looks like. And it says wet and wild on the other side. It does say cruelty free. I like this. Has a little loofah. This looks like it is pigmented. Okay, let's try it. It's very much, so it's not sticky. It does not have a scent like the other one does, but I guess it is like really buildable because look at this color. really pretty summer shade ladies super pretty i like this for the summer so this is what it is i'll put up the number in case you guys are interested and want this specific color or want to look out for it there you go but see like you can just put some of your lipsticks in here so that's what I got these for. And I was kind of thinking like pink and gray or maybe black and gray. I don't know. I want it to look pretty, so I have to play around with it and see. But sticking with the color, I mean with the color, with the makeup, they also had these Wet n Wild um, eyeshadow palettes. Wow, that took me a minute. It's called Col Color Color Onic? Color icon color icon wow jennifer i cannot talk today okay so, so let me just open them ladies i have three different um colors that i found them in i did get all three wow they're really making this difficult for me let me see if i stab it <laughs> with a pen yeah, that helps. So my store only had three different color combos. Here's one of them. Really pretty, guys. Really, really pretty. Let me open it so that... Oh, it brings four shades. It looked like, because this covers it, it looked like it only had three. Look at how beautiful these colors are. Very neutral. Let's swatch. Because, I mean, it's one thing to have to see the color. But if it's not going to be pigmented or give you color payoff, then what is the purpose of purchasing it, you know? Woo! Hold on, guys. Let me pick that up real quick. I thought I was going to shatter. Oh, boy. Okay. These two, what I was going to say was that these two kind of have almost very similar, like, you see, very similar in color. This is a really pretty metallic one. I love, this is like rose gold, okay? So this is going to be your rose gold color. Beautiful. Then let's try, wow, that's pretty too. Oh yeah, guys, pick this up. Look at that. That color payoff is awesome. So this was one of the color variations that I found. Of course, I don't have a napkin. Hold on. Let's open up the next one. This one is very similar in color to that one. So I almost didn't pick this one up. But then I said, it's $1.25. Like, why not? You know, like, you always end up convincing yourself. Come on. Oh 
almost got it, guys. Sorry. Okay. Oh, check. Okay. They present it to you like this. So I almost didn't pick it up because they look alike, you know? Guys, what? What? Beautiful turquoise shade. Wow. Okay. Let me use my other hand. Yes. It's hard to find a turquoise color that really shows up. Um, because a lot of times they really don't show up on the skin. Look at how pretty that color is for the, um, oh my Lord, for like a base color. This is really pretty for like your um, eyebrow bone. And then this beautiful shiny, look at that. I don't know if you guys can see, you see that sparkle? pretty guys really pretty pick those up they're good wow if you have um a teen or a preteen that you allow to wear makeup and they're starting out with makeup and they want to learn or even yourself if you're practicing with eyeshadows and um you want to learn how to apply makeup these are great to pick up and practice. Now let's see what they surprised us with down here. Ready? I don't know. Oh, okay, it's a brown. Okay, well, this is beautiful. One thing that I learned when I was taking um, makeup courses is that if you have brown eyes, blues are great for brown eyes, especially if you do a brown, um, not brown, a blue, um, eyeliner wow i'm sorry guys <laughs> my words today don't want to come out but if you use a blue eyeliner it really helps bring out the brown eyes even if you use a blue on your lid believe it or not it helps bring out the brown eyes so let's see oh guys what what i'm running out of space but what dude wow I'm speechless. Let's try this one now. We're doing this on my arm. <gasps> this is another really pretty rose goldish color. Guys, these are good. These are Jen approved. <laughs> not like that matters, but wow. And last but not least, let's see yes these are all four of the colors on this little palette pick these up you're not going to regret it they are great and i wonder no i was trying to see if i could fit them on this little container but no they don't fit okay um let me see if i could continue to do this without getting eyeshadow all over all the items but let me just throw this garbage here okay I found this book and for some reason the cover definitely gravitated to me. It's called Little Scratch by Rebecca Watson and on here it says, I couldn't put it down. It has broken my heart and opened my mind. Um, the book says it's a $23.95. $23 so I'm going to read you just a little prompt from here. She wakes up, goes to work, watches the clock, and checks her phone. But underneath this mononity, I don't know how to say that word, sorry. <laughs> there's only, there's something else going on, something under her skin. Relayed in interweaving columns that chart the feedback loop of memory, the senses and modern distractions with wit and precision, little scratch, shows our narrator becoming increasingly anxious as the day moves on. Is she overusing the heart emoji? Will drinking eight glasses of water a day really fix everything? Why is the etiquette of a woman's bathroom so fraught? How does she define rape? And why can't she stop scratching? Slay and, pro and profound little scratch is def 
defiantly playful look at how our minds function in and survive our darkest moments. So I don't know, guys. I picked it up. I saw the inside. All the pages are like that. So it doesn't look like it's a book that is that long to read, you know? Like it doesn't have so many, like I just want you guys to see how there's not so many words, which kind of said to me, okay, I could probably read this book in a few days and be done with it and get to the point because that's my thing. I like to rush through and like get to the point. Um, but I'm, I want to read it. I don't know. I just want to read it. So let's see. I'm putting that to the side because then I'm going to show you guys who here remembers Goosebumps growing up. Goosebumps was a popular book series that you could get through Scholastics. Who remembers ordering books through uh, Scholastics? I remember ordering all the books and all the things. Mm. Sorry, the bookmarks. I loved it all. Well, I loved Goosebumps. My brother, who is two years younger than me, he had all the books too, and we used to share them. And then I remember they came out, well, they recently came out with like a series on Netflix or something. But Greenbrier has come out with Creepers. And they have this one. I think I got the entire series. The Golden Goblet. And these books, let's see how many pages. um one 124 pages and this is kind of like you see the words are pretty big so it's not going to take your kid a long time to read or if you want it for yourself and it it shows let's see i think there's five books in total because it shows me here five do i have five yeah guys i think i got the entire series i'm excited i got these for my son he's 12 he's gonna be 13 in October and I just thought that he might enjoy these so I picked these up this one is called Ghost Rider what a cool cover right this one is called the piano spooky this one is called stage fright <laughs> look at my arm and my hand guys and this one is called pen pals this looks super spooky so i don't know i picked these up i thought it would be fun to give these to him and have him do something other than play playstation guys these kids nowadays they're glued to their phones or to playstation but this is it i got the entire series i'm so excited about that um because i definitely wanted to get that for him then i found these color changing cups i'm trying to I only purchased two of them, and I'll show you guys. I got this one that says, they all said summer vibes, and then they had this pink one. If they would have had the purple one, I would have gotten the purple one. But I got this one because then it looks more manly, so either my husband or my son can use this, and my daughter and I can use this one. We have a ton of tumblers. We do not need these, but... They're fun for the summertime. If you're making margaritas or something, you can just throw them in here too. A frozen drink, a milkshake. And it, they change colors. So guys, why not? And for a buck 25, like this gives me Starbucks vibes. I have the ones from Starbucks that change colors and I have the cold ones and the hot ones. And let me just tell you that you end up losing the pieces to them. Then with summer in mind, I did pick these up. Okay, I was a little upset because I wanted, I'll show you guys. So I got the pineapple. I figured either fruits or chips or hors d'oeuvres and dip. Super cute. Then, of course, I got the lemon and the watermelon. I'm on the hunt for the little dish. They only had this one, but this was so, so cute. And I really want to find a little dish to go with it. That way I kind of have just two pieces from each set and I have them.
for summertime and for entertaining purposes. And as you guys know, we've been really making use of our little balcony and going out there and enjoying the weather. Last night we had dinner out there. The night before we kind of did the same and we've just been enjoying it, so that's that then guys i was so excited i should have got more of these i don't know why i only got one but whatever i got the mach the washing machine cleaner deep clean formula so if you guys don't know we recently moved into this house in december this is my first time having a washer and dryer in the house at our old house we used to have to go to the laundry mat and so forth but this is supposed to remove odor causing residues in any washer it's supposed to be like the Tide and it brings three and it gives you instructions on how to use it. So I'm going to use this and clean out our washing machine um, one of these days and I'll let you guys know what I think of it. I mean, I don't know what I would compare it to, pero, as you know, then guys, I had picked up the Wizard brand um, laundry pods and I love those. They're sold out in all of my stores. I have not found them. But then I found these. It's called Dryer Soft Ultra Laundry Packs. Platinum Laundry, laundry Packs Fresh Scent for All Machines. Quick and easy. Works in both HE and regular washers. It brings 10. Let's smell it. I picked up six of these because we do a lot of laundry here. They smell good. Let's see what they look like. So they're like this. So I picked up six of these and for some reason I thought that these were the ones, the wizard ones. They're not. Let me know in the comments if you guys have used these. Um, they're not a green briar product. It says distributed by Bay Converting INC from Green, ba green Bay, Wisconsin. I do still have a wizards pack in my... Um, in my under my sink where I keep my laundry stuff and I was looking at the distributor but they're not the same so they're not made by the same company as the wizard ones but let me know if you guys think that these are any good if you guys have tried those because like I said I picked up six thinking that I had hit jackpot well maybe I did who knows then but of course I had to pick up these two because why not I am going, so my bathroom in my bedroom has a shower curtain that I got at Walmart that I love. It's white and it has grays and pink, so it, it looks like Paris. So it's like gray and pink, kind of Paris theme. So I picked up the two frames that I hauled in one of my Dollar Tree Pass hauls. You guys can check that out. Let me know if you want me to link it below and I'll look for it. But I got the two frames that have the pictures of the perfume bottles. So I said, well, I'm gonna put those in my bathroom and then I'm going to decorate with these on my little, um, on the sink and stuff and make it look really, really pretty. So I'm excited about that. I mean, guys, these are gorgeous. This is like a smoky gray and this is a pink. I've heard that some people are finding them in clear. My store did not have clear. They had the smoky gray and they had the pink. So that's that. And then this does remove. You can put something in here if you want. I'm going to leave it as is. I think it's beautiful just like that. Then guys, look at how stinking cute. What? So this is called the Crayola Coloring Case. Hashtag squad goals. <laughs> It includes 40 coloring pages, four crayons, and one case. And I thought this was super cute. Of course, I'm gonna give this to my daughter for my grandson. He's still little, you know, but he'll be able to use this. Maybe I'll save this for his birthday because I ha I've saved a bunch of Hot Wheels that I hauled from the Dollar Tree and the little Hot Wheels case and things like that. Or maybe for Christmas, who knows? But I'll probably save it for that and give it to him for that. But I just thought this was cute. She could carry it in her purse or in his little bag and when they're out and give him this. And then this, oh my God, how cute. First of all, it is an activity pack from Crayola for ages three and up. It includes 30 coloring pages, 
four crayons, but these are the twistable crayons, guys. These are going to last you because these are the twistables. So that is super cool. So I picked up two. They had a whole bunch. I should have gotten more, but then I said, what am I going to get them for? My son is 12. My daughter is 21. My other daughter is 20. Like, but then I said, I'm going to use it. <laughs> so I got two. I don't know. Of course, one is going to be for my grandson, but we'll see what I do with the other one. Or we can save it for a birthday gift or something. Who knows? Then I had seen Mari call these. And my daughter, my oldest, the one that lives with me, she is obsessed with the passion fruit juice from Welch's. I always buy it for her every time we go out, but it doesn't last. Like literally this girl eats like a man, but she's super skinny. Like what? How? <laughs> but she drinks this in like two or three days. So I was telling her last night that I had found these. My store had a lot of these, so I just got two. Um, so she can try it and she could let me know if she likes them. And if she likes them, like we usually have water bottles. But now my husband also started filling up our water cooler. Because fun fact, our bird Miss Tina and our four dogs, um, we give them like water. We don't give them water from the sink. We give them spring water. Um, so <laughs> that's a fun fact. But he filled up our water um, tank so we can always either use one of these tumblers or our you know other tumblers our cups or a water bottle fill it up and grab one of these and take it so that's that then oh my god guys i found this and i fell in love with this this is so beautiful first of all look at the sparkle it says love lives here but get this take out the little thingamajiggy Look at how pretty it lights up, guys. I thought this was so cute. There was also another one that says, I choose joy. But dude, this literally like goes with all my decor. It's like farmhouse chic type of decor. And I just thought it was really, really pretty. And you could either put this on a tear tray. I'm gonna put it somewhere in my living room. And I just thought it was so, so pretty. Like, look at that. I could stare at this all day. <laughs> It's so pretty. So, and that's what the bag looks like if you're interested. But yeah, guys, love this. Love it. Dollar Tree is doing it right, guys. They are on to something. Then I found this cute little hair clip. It just has daisies on it. And this is like the kind that I like. Even though I cut my hair, I still just grab it. And I do the little twisty twist. And then I'll just come in with a a clip like this and clip it up Ija. it's up right so i thought this was super cute especially now for the spring and summer so i picked that up then um i got one of these because i like this scent for my son's room he's a growing teenage boy preteen. so you know boys rooms get stinky so i grabbed this for that and oh, it just smells so good. So I'm going to change the one he has in his room and put that one in because it's time to change it. Then, guys, I found there was a lot more. So I grabbed three, one for me and each of my girls. Um, it's a five-minute flash masking. And it's from Yes to Tomatoes. It says, to, it says it's new. Clear skin for breakout pro, uh, prone skin. Like, hello, I'm breaking out right now, so I need this. But it looks like you just apply the mask from the stick. It almost reminds me of like a deodorant. So I got one for me and for each of my girlies. So that's that. Then I did sticking with skincare. I did get these. These only bring one, so I don't really know if it's that great of a deal, but I got four of these, the Bior strips. Then guys, oh my God, my store has never had these before. This is the Pepto Herbal, Herbal Blends Ginger and Chamomile, and it's to relieve nausea and vomiting, and it brings 14 capsules. So I got two just in case to have on hand in case anybody
gets nauseous or starts to vomit, unfortunately, we have that to offer. Then, I've never seen this coffee, but this is Espresso Cafe El Moro. And this says that, it, I think I read somewhere that, yeah, it comes from Puerto Rico. But the fun fact is that it is located in Hoboken, New Jersey, which is super close to me, like literally five minutes away from me. So I thought that was cool. Um, we usually use Cafe Pilon or Cafe Bustelo. And there's another one, Llave, Cafe Llave, that my husband likes. And that's usually when we use like the, I think they call it the Italian espresso maker that you use on the stove top. So sometimes we'll do that. But fun fact, you can buy the, seal, the seals that you can put on the pods if you have an espresso and you can put your own coffee um, grounds in there, like the espresso in there so that you can make it using your Nespresso machine. And I'm going like that because my machine is right there. <laughs> but that's that, I'm gonna try that out. Then keeping in mind with coffee, I found the Pure Protein Complete Protein Shake complete protein shake and salted caramel and rich chocolate and i picked up two of these why because i make my latte at home using the salted caramel syrup from tioni i think is the brand that i think that's how you say it i figured that this would be a healthier option for me to make it and it might make me fuller so that i'm not you know eating more Although I don't eat a lot. I don't know, guys. It's a whole thing. But anyway, um, I got that for that purpose. I've heard of a lot of people using this and mixing this with their coffee. So I'm going to try it. I only got one. Well, I got two of each flavor just in case if they went flying off the shelves. Um, I And I liked it. I wanted to, you know, be able to have that. And then last but not least, guys, Celsius. What? At the Dollar Tree? This stuff is expensive, and I drink this in the summertime when we go to the pool and stuff. There's a flavor that has guayaba in it that I love, but this one is a little different. It's called Trop it's the Tropical Twist, and it's Celsius uh, Live Fit Carbonated BCAA Energy Fuels Recovery Tart Cherry and Electrolytes. So... It's supposed to give you hydration, muscle recovery, vitamin D3, and energy. Um, it has, yeah, vitamin D3. So I don't know. I'm going to give this a shot and see if I like it. And then this one is the blood orange lemonade. I didn't even notice the flavors. I just saw that they were different. They only had these two flavors, so I only got one of each. I will let you guys know what I think, but that is it, guys, for my Dollar Tree haul. We've made it at 33 minutes almost. <laughs> Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, so much for supporting my channel. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for watching. Thank you guys for the likes and for commenting and all the things. But if you're new here and you like what you see, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button for me. But most importantly, subscribe and hit the bell so that you get notified every time I upload a new video. That way you don't miss out. I am starting to do a lot of plus size um, fashion. Um, I'm showing you guys a lot of Timu hauls and a lot of Dollar Tree. And I'm going to be cooking with you guys a lot more too. And all the things, guys, we're just going to have fun over here, you know. That's what we're going to do. We're going to have fun. And for those that don't know, I'm from New Jersey, so I, everything that I bring to you is from Hudson County, New Jersey. I'm super close to New York City. Like, I literally can see, fun fact, I can see the tippity top of the Empire State Building from my balcony. So maybe one of these nights, I will film a little clip so that you guys can see it a little. But yes, so there you go. Thanks again, guys. Hugs and kisses, and I hope everyone is having an amazing uh, Friday. And please stay safe this weekend. Enjoy yourselves with your families and stay safe. Bye now.